Hi everyone. I wanted to make a quick video to show this new blue SCSI mounting bracket for the Mac SE or SE30 that Joel Crane created. It allows you to access the blue SCSI's SD card via the Max expansion slot and features a light pipe that shows the blue SCSI's status and activity LEDs. He's selling these nicely made brackets on his Etsy store. Link in the description below. I love the sound of old hard drives, but they will eventually die, and solutions like the blue SCSI adapter are critical for keeping retro computers running. Not having to crack open your Mac whenever you want to swap SD cards is why I wanted a bracket like this. So let's get to the install. First start by taking the screws out of the bracket. Then slide the blue SCSI in with the SD slot facing outwards and the light pipe positioned over the LEDs. Then screw the blue SCSI into the bracket. Next we'll crack this Mac open by removing the four Torx screws. You'll of course need the longer Torx bit to reach the screws in the handle. By the way, these padded envelopes you may often get in shipping are excellent for working on compact Macs and CRTs as they protect the system and make it easy to slide them around. Let's get this old, albeit nicely sounding, hard drive out. Connect the internal SCSI cable to the blue SCSI adapter. Position the bracket into the expansion slot and screw it in. Then connect the aux power cable. If the blue SCSI doesn't detect an SD card or a usable drive image, the LED status will blink, in this case five times. Joel has put a handy guide on the bracket to show that five flashes means no SD card and three means no drive image. It works much better now with an SD card installed. Next, remove the expansion slot cover by gently pushing it from the inside out. I find it helps to brace the outside of the bracket with my other hand. Well, I'm really happy with how this turned out. You can grab one of these brackets from Joel's Etsy store linked below. And of course, check out the wonderful blue SCSI adapters. Links to them are also below. And please be sure to like and subscribe and all that other YouTube stuff. It really helps. Thanks, and see ya.